Well, hello, how's my Googles doing today? In today's video, I will be making stuffed chicken breasts. And here are the ingredients that I have, okay? Let me bring you down a little bit so you can see. I have three chicken breasts. I have some onion as well as red pepper. I have a half a cup of uh, cheddar cheese as well as mozzarella cheese. I have broccoli here. I have cream cheese over here. Four ounces of cream cheese, paprika, black pepper, onion powder, crushed red pepper, garlic powder, chicken, cheese and chicken seasoning, and some salt, and some olive oil, okay? So what I'm going to do first is saute the vegetables a little bit. So I'm going to turn my pan and bring y'all down a little bit more so y'all can see what I'm doing. Heat up my pan a little bit. And it's not going to take that long because these chicken breasts are pretty small. So it won't be that long. I might not even need to put them in the oven, but we'll see. Well, yeah, I'm going to put them in there. Let me preheat my oven to 450. Take these little vegetables first. And I'm going to incorporate the broccoli in here too. Just to help it along a little bit. Probably about that much there. Because like I said, these chicken breasts are not that big. So it won't take us long at all. So I'm going to put a little crushed red pepper. And this is going to be for the filling, the inside of the uh, chicken, okay? Some garlic powder. And you season your food to your taste, okay? This is onion powder. And this is black pepper. And I'm going to put a little salt in there. That's it. It's not a whole lot, I don't think it is. But this this should be enough for those uh, three chicken breasts. Like I said, they are very small. Okay. Okay, I think that's good enough. So I'm going to season the chicken and I'll be right back. So I put a little garlic powder, little onion powder now, I'm putting some garlic powder, some of my kicking chicken seasoning, a little crushed red pepper, not a whole lot, just a little bit, just like that there. Little paprika. Okay. I'm just letting this mixture back here cool down a little bit, okay? While we season these chicken breasts. And then don't be afraid to season the inside too because you want those 
flavors to be all the way through your meat, okay? I ain't going to hurt none. Just a little bit more on the inside. And make sure you're washing your hands when you're messing with chicken. And wipe, wipe off your seasonings once you're done. A little bit more paprika. Oh, that smells good. Now I haven't even really done anything yet, y'all. Smells amazing. Just gonna add a little salt on the chicken, not a whole lot. Got that much there. Okay, I'm gonna take my vegetables out of this pan here and place them right here on this plate. Okay, I'm getting ready to put some avocado oil in this pan, okay? About that much there. We're just going to brown these chicken breasts a little bit so they have some color to them once they come out the oven. Okay, but they have been seasoned. So now we're getting ready to put the mixture together, okay? A half a cup of uh, char cheddar and a half a cup of mozzarella cheese and four ounces of cream cheese salt to room temperature, okay? I'll place that in there. And then I'm gonna attempt to cut this broccoli up just a little bit, okay? Just like that there. Okay, so this is what we're looking like so far, okay? Let me get my spoon and mix that up. I'll make sure y'all can see this here, okay? Smells good, y'all. Smells really good. And it's gonna be good too. I'm gonna taste this mixture and see how it, how it tastes and see if I need to add anything prior to me uh putting it in the chicken breast. But it's smelling good. Mmm. doesn't need anything doesn't need anything at all well to be stuffed in this chicken breast over here but it is smelling good y'all okay y'all got me a couple of uh two picks to help hold the clothes while we brown it before I put it in the oven. But we're getting ready to stuff these babies. Hope you guys can see this all right. Okay. About like that there. Stuff that on the inside of this chicken breast. Oh man, that's gonna be good.
Wow, that's gonna be good, good, good. Okay. We gonna have to make that one do what it do. But get that stuffing all down in that middle, just like this here. You would have to go in with your hand. Get it all in there, okay? All in there. This was more than enough. I still got some left. I'm going to see if I can't stuff all that in here. A little bit more in each one. <laughs> This looks good, y'all. And it smells amazing. Probably could have stuffed about four chicken breasts. But that's okay. This is this gonna work. Oh wow, this smells good, y'all. I'm telling you. Let me rinse my hands before I Ooh, this looks so good, y'all. I'm telling you. Mm hmm. That's my oven. She was telling me it's ready. I may have put too much in here, but that's okay. We're going to make it do what it do. And the two picks is just to keep everything inside, okay? Let me get ready to get this oil together. This is smelling good, y'all, and it ain't even cooked yet. Okay, so this is what you want right here. See how that is? This is exactly what you want, okay? And we're just going to put this in the skillet here to brown a little bit. I didn't realize these breasts were this small, but that's okay. We're going to make it work. But the next time I make this, I'm going to get the chicken breast with the skin and the bone on it. I think that would be really, really good. But this is what we're looking like. The chicken breasts are all stuffed. I mean, they stuff to capacity, but that's okay. And we just wanted to get a little brown because we don't have any skin on here. So get them brown in this pan prior to us. Putting them in the oven, okay? So they have a little color on them once they come out the oven. So I'm going to start with this side down. Okay, that needs to get a little hotter. It ain't hot enough. 
Okay, I'm getting ready to place these other two in here. And like I said, this is just to brown it a little bit to help it have some nice color on it. Y'all see that there? Just got them in. Just going to let them get brown on one side and then we're going to flip them over. Okay, I am getting ready to take these chicken breasts out and place them in my pan. So they can go in the oven. Oh, it smells good, y'all. I'm telling you, it smells really, really good. Get out all the toothpicks, okay? Mmm. Yum, yum. Ooh. Yes, yes. Oh, my mouth. I can't wait to dig into these babies. Oh, wait. Mm-mm-mm. Wow. That's good, y'all. I'm just going to get a little of this uh, chicken broth here to deglaze the pan a little bit. Just to add that into the, to the bottom of the chicken broth for some more. That's all I wanted right here, y'all. Just to deglaze this pan a little bit, okay? I'm going to pull that in here at the bottom of this just to have a little moisture so these don't dry out in the oven. Alright, this is what we're looking like, okay? And I'm getting ready to put them in the oven for Alright, the stuffed chicken breasts are done. And this is what we're looking like. I'm getting ready to plate me up one so we can see how I did. Stuffed chicken breasts. Alright, let me see if I can't get this small one up out of here. This is the one I want right here. And I wind up putting the rest of that broccoli at the bottom, okay? Ooh, look at all that cheese. Can y'all see that there? Oh, wow. That looks amazing. Okay, I just wanted to let you guys know that I used the avocado oil. I did not use the extra virgin olive oil. I have two bottles that I go between. But today I use the avocado oil, okay? All right, let me say my grace, and let's get a taste. All right, let's taste it and see how we did. But I think they came out amazing. <clears throat> oh, I'm hot. The oven got it hot in here. Look at all of that in there. Y'all see all that feeling? Oh, wow. Mmm. Mmm, that's good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Make sure y'all try this. Stuffed chicken breast. Wow. This is good. I'm dropping juice everywhere. Mmm. That's got yeah, hot too. Ooh, that's good, y'all. That's good. Let me get one more bite for y'all. Did y'all see that feeling right there? Oh, yeah. You see all that in there? Did y'all see that there? Mm. This is good. I kid you not. You better make y'all some. This is low carb too. Mm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Ooh, wow. Mm -hmm -hmm. Make sure y'all get all the two picks out as well, okay? Mm. Ooh, that's good. Mm, I'm hot. The oven made it hot in here. Mm. Mm. 
www.nellybomb.com. I want to say thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And as you exit, hit that bell so you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. All right? Please comment, like, share, and subscribe. Okay? And hit that bell as you exit. All right? Till the next time, remember, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye now. Till the next time.